Hi everybody, Lance here at TransWest Truck Trailer RV located in Belton, Missouri. Today I'm uh, really excited to bring to you this 2017 King Air by Newmar. It's a 4533 model. Absolutely gorgeous. Uh, this was previously owned by a professional NASCAR racer. There is so much custom work that he did to this coach. Uh, you'll be pretty impressed. Just give me a call, I'll send you over the MSRP and you can kind of see how this coach was put together. But to start out, one of the things I want to point out is just this big front cap, right? You're going to notice that you don't see any windshield wipers here. They're all kind of tucked and hidden here in the front cap. Just absolutely beautiful. You've got your marker lights here on the mirrors. Uh, they're all nice, beautifully chromed out. I like the badging here on the front. It's not just painted on. They actually machined out these parts, so it's all nice raised badging here in the front. And one of the other things that I really like is this whole front cap just absolutely gorgeous it's going to have a 12,500 watt Onan diesel generator and i'm going to go ahead and bump this cap out so you can just see how kind of neat it is all right guys now that i got the front uh part of this king air opened up i just want to point out some really neat features when you're in a nice luxury coach like this the last thing you ever want to do is have any kind of downtime and if you do the most important thing you want is to have that thing back on the road ASAP. So King Air put in some uh, functionality here that if it ever needed to get worked on, it's gonna get you out on the road. This is gonna be easy for a technician to just open up this bay and then access the generator pretty easy. It also has an emergency uh, suspension exhaust field. You do have a right here. So if you got a problem with the, the suspension, maybe the coach might be leaning one way or the other. You do have a way for a, a mobile tech to get out here, get you up and running, get you down the road until you can get to the next service station. Easy access for the uh, windshield wipers. All the lights are going to be easily ac accessed here. So getting to all your bulbs, all the different parts here, really nice. All right, as we come down the coach, you're going to see that typical to Newmar here, this is where they like to put the I like, it doesn't matter whether it's the Dutch Star, whether it's the London Air, whether it's the King Air, they have some uh, pretty basic common things all throughout the coaches. That makes it really nice for serviceability. Um, kind of a neat little deal. You got your little windshield wiper or your, uh, your window scrubber there. All right, as we come down, this bay is typically where people like to put pressure sprayers I see a lot of these King Airs come in and that's where they'll they'll put like a little mobile pressure sprayer so you can clean out the front of the coach clean off all the bugs now these trays they're a thousand pound weight capacity they are going to be power they just do have a switch so if you want to bring it out you just push a button you don't have to go to your storage you bring your storage out to you so pretty neat little feature So now that will go either direction. It does have a power cord reel. You got your big inverter there. Next bay over, this is our wet bay. So some lot of, lot of things going on here. I think we probably need to spend a little time on this. As you can see up here in the top left corner, that's gonna be the water manifold. That's something that you typically see in a residential home. If you have a leak in a motor home, typically we gotta do shut the water off to the entire coach. Now what that means is you can't flush your toilet, you can't take a shower. With this thing, with, with the water manifold on the King Air, it makes it really nice because you can just isolate the problem and then you can continue to can use the rest of the plumbing in the coach. So really nice residential features. You've got a hot water tap there. This is really nice. If you've got a mobile uh, pressure sprayer, you can hook up to that. You got hot water. Um, you've got a macerator system. You can have the choice of either doing a manual dump or you can do the macerator. Got your water purification system. You do have um, your tank levels. It lets you know what your fresh gray and black water is. And uh, just a lot of neat uh, functionality throughout this coach. Now the next bay over is gonna be the battery bay. Now this thing, the 2017 King Air, comes with 16 six volt batteries. I did not stutter. 16 6-volt batteries. This thing is going to have 
all the battery power you want to run anything in this coach and do it for a while. I mean, 16 6 volt batteries is quite a bit. The coach does come with a side mounted radiator. They did order this with the Gerard Nova awning package. So what that means is you're going to have power window awnings. You're going to come with the two Gerard Nova awnings in the uh, patio side. This particular coach does come with a 600 horsepower ISX Cummins motor. It is built on the K3 Spartan chassis. So pretty nice. Now the, the way they set the King Air up is you don't have to come over here. Everything's meant to be easy, right? You just flip this valve and it will raise and give you access to the rear motor. When you're done, you just flip the valve down and it shuts the door for you. Now over here, you're gonna have your chassis batteries. I like the fact uh, all your filters here are gonna be pretty easily accessible. These are gonna be your uh, fuses here for like your your uh, backup lights, brake lights, things of that nature. All right. I like the stainless steel kit that they put on the, the bottom part of this. It protects the paint of the coach. This is gonna be your death. Diesel exhaust wood. Now this coach, you'll see that the rear tire here, the tag axle is a passive tag axle. It'll actually turn with the coach. So as you're making them lefts and them rights, it, it means less wear and tear on your tag tire and gives you a little bit sharper turning radius. You do got your Sony TV there uh, with the Bose sound bar. And what I do like is that they have a really nice feature. You don't have to guess. You can flip this, you can flip this function to where the Bose ties into the TV pretty easy. Flip it over to where it says TV or flip it to where it says dash radio. So you can play you can play the uh, radio station off the dash of the of the coach. You do have a nice little Dometic refrigerator freezer. It does pull completely out. It does come with central vac. You've got some outlets there. You've got one just right there. And what's nice about that, it's a great place where you can plug in, maybe charge up your phones, your iPads, things of that nature. All right, moving on. So I left this tray out on purpose just to kind of give you a demonstration. I can control that tray from either side of the coach. So if I want to bring it out this direction, no problem. I just push this nice little button here. And it does all the work for me. Now, as I bring this tray out, as I said before, this thing is a thousand pound weight capacity. Now they did design this to where you can lift this front lip off of the tray. So if you got something a little extra heavy and you don't want to get it up over there, this just makes it easier for loading it up. And you does come with another one. So you got two power slide trays in this coach. Now, I think you remember me earlier telling you about how a lot of people will put a pressure sprayer in that bay that was just on the driver's side. Well, they chose to do it on the, on the passenger side instead of the driver's side. So you do have your nice little, that was the um, pressure sprayer that a lot of people like to bring along with their coach. So you have a nice easy way to kind of wash the bugs off the front of the coach, keep the coach clean. Now, as we step away from the coach, you're going to see that it's got this Beautiful, beautiful paint job. This was a custom custom color paint job. And as you look at the uh, all the windows here, they're frameless windows, and you do have the power window awnings over the living room, over the bedroom. So it's a nice way to keep direct sunlight coming into the coach, but uh, just overall, really nice coach. Now, as we come up to the door here, this coach does have the hydraulic steps. It's got a sensor in the front and it's got a sensor underneath. So if I were to open and close this door, it will stop the steps. So it's not smashing into your leg. And it does have the keyless entry. Forget your keys, just remember your code and you'll have easy access into the coach. All right guys, well that does it for the exterior. Let's go ahead and head on inside. All right guys, welcome to the inside of this beautiful 2017 King Air. So one of the things I'd like to just touch base on is this, uh, when we first walk into this coach, we look at these beautiful uh, 
porcelain tile floors. I love the, it's like the old barn wood style. Just a really neat look. Um, you know, even a lot of the newer King Errors are, they've continued with this theme uh, and just changed colors throughout the years. It's been so popular. And um, up here in the front, I just kind of want to point out one of the things that makes the King Error pretty special in this class is it does come with hydraulic leveling. You got two different uh, ways of controlling how you level this coach. If you're going to a really hot environment, you may not want to put your jacks down, your hydraulic jacks. You might want to just air level it so it's not pushing the jack through the asphalt. So you have a choice of doing air leveling or hydraulic leveling. Um, you do have some really nice big oversized monitors. This is going to have your 360 degree camera system, your side and left camera. So overall, there's going to be seven cameras to help give you a great view for this. You're going to have a command central here. This is where you go through and you can control all the different functions of the of the coach, your uh, your climate, your AC power, your DC power, uh, your gen set. Um, well, we just turned it off. We want that AC running. It's a pretty hot day today, so let's turn that back on. Boom. Uh, your floor heat. We can go through and adjust the different zones in the coach. Uh, this will have um, the heated tile floors underneath. One of the nice features I like about King Air, you'll notice that they have this nice little stainless steel uh, guard here for the screen door. That's nice for pets. You get a pet that wants to push down on the, on the screen, you got that nice beautiful King Air logo there and it keeps them from pushing through the screen. Now you do have a step cover here and I like how the step cover not only comes out but it also raises up and it does come flush to the floor. Now, one of the things you might notice in this coach is I'm actually standing where a chair would be. So this coach was custom built uh, for the customer. The previous customer of this coach, um, he was a professional NASCAR race car driver and he just didn't want a chair as he came in through here. So we do, don't worry, we do have a chair on order. It will be coming in to match this here as well. And these chairs, they might take a little while because these are going to be heated, cooled. Uh, you've got massage, func massage functions here. So, and as you can see, you've got a lot of different functions to make sure that you're going to really enjoy the drive. You're going to be able to do it in comfort. All right. So now as we, as we come through this coach, one of the nice things that that's pretty common with Newmar is their televators. I do like the fact that you're not sacrificing your windows here. You know, during the, uh, you know, during the day, you might want that TV down so you can kind of see your view. Um, and you do have a nice little workspace. So if you're going to do a little work from home, keep in touch with family, you got a nice little workspace here. You do have your sound bar. You do got a Bose, Bose system set up here. You do got the nice fireplace. And as we uh, pan through here, now the customer took a lot of detail in making sure the, there's about a page and a half worth of aftermarket options that he did to this coach. Um, he just changed out everything, even like the balances that you see here on all the windows. Uh, they did not come standard. He actually ordered it that way. And um, so just a lot of neat things. You can get a hold of me. I'll send you that MSRP so you can kind of see the breakdown, but it's a lot. Um, this particular couch here and the dinette, they're both going to be power. and. Um, so we're going to do, through the power technology, we're going to do a little hyperlapse and kind of show you what that looks like. All right, guys. Well, through the power technology, we got all the, we got the dinette open. We got the couch here opened up. Uh, as you can see, it adds a lot of extra seating for the dining area. Nice extra seating here for the living room area. Uh, this table will pull out. You got a little bit of storage underneath uh, just below. Um, and one of the other cool features while you're there, let me just see if I can bring some of these shades down. Does have uh, power shades at the push of the button. So at the end of the night, you don't have to go and close each one individually. If you want to call it a day, push a couple of buttons and you're off and running. So. Again, with Newmar, one of the things that I really like about what they do here 
is everything in this coach is going to have a trim level. We are in the King Air, so uh, a lot of nice finishes. And instead of seeing those big rectangular registers or those big round pucks, you're going to notice here in the ceiling, okay, the trim level that they have on this. Now, right now, we do have the AC on, and uh, what makes that significant is you don't hear a whole lot of noise. It's a whisper quiet AC. It's completely outside of the coach. They pipe it in. That way you don't have to raise the volume up on the TV in order to, uh, when you have your air conditioner on. So, pretty nice little feature. And uh, now as we pan through the rest of this coach, I'm gonna show you here the kitchen. Absolutely gorgeous. They got a, a, a multi-level countertop here. So when you do get where you're going, you got a little area here for like spices. Uh, you still have enough room back here for like maybe a coffee pot or maybe a spice rack. Uh, true to Numar, they do have their induction cooktop. This is going to be an all electric coach, so no propane. And again, with this uh, particular cooktop, you can take this out uh, wherever you're at, put this out on the picnic table, and do all your cooking out there. If you're going to cook some fish and you want to kind of keep that smell outside the coach. And they do have some uh, nice little cutting boards here on the other side. It doesn't just look nice, it's actually pretty practical. And then, if we look at the black, the backsplash here, I like how they run it all the way up. You're going to notice, um, now this is something that you typically don't see, uh, not even in the a lot of the newer King Airs. You can see just how many outlets you've got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight 110 outlets. You've got a couple USB ports there. So a uh, nice power bar there to make sure that you got plenty of power for all your appliances. And then you're gonna have this really, just a massive farm sink. This thing is absolutely huge. Beautiful stainless steel. You do have your nice little um, residential faucet here, your purified water. So just a nice little, nice little setup. And you know, you are in the RV, and I do like how they have a nice separation of space. You got your dinette across from your kitchen. I like how they bring this down here because if you've got somebody sitting over here, the last thing you want is have water rolling off of your countertop this way. So they put a lot of thought into this. These cabinets are all solid wood. You've got a nice built in drawers here, they're all soft clothes. So pretty neat little feature. You got a convection microwave oven, got your, uh, you got your Fisher Paykel washer dryer down below. Nice big drawer. Little extra storage here. And let's just go ahead and pull these out. That way you can kind of see, these are really deep. I mean, so you're gonna be getting a lot of storage with this coach. These are all soft clothes. Okay, as we uh, come through the coach, you're gonna see that we do have the Whirlpool refrigerator. You've got a really nice uh, oversized pantry. Drawers pull out really nice and deep. Now, because we are in the 17, you're in a new enough year, as you, as you look down here at the bottom of the floor, you're gonna notice one thing is that there is no carpet. Typically in this area, you're gonna see that there would be carpet. Uh, Numar found a way to be able to put tile on the slide out without it breaking every time it comes in and out. The customer did uh, do an add-on for this particular coach. He added stainless steel in the kick plate down below. So um, as we go on through this coach, and then if I ever do, if we ever, if you do get a hold of me and I send you the MSRP, I think it's, you're just going to be blown away the add-ons that he added to this coach. He spared no expense. I like the handle here. Now this, the way the door, typically when you're coming out of bathrooms, the handle would want to snag snag your clothing so this is kind of an anti-snag setup that they got here i like the way that it pivots here so that way if the slide is closed you can still get into the bathroom you've got a really nice big uh, vanity setup here a lot of counter space plenty of drawer space here and let's see yeah typical here for numar they have a nice everything has a trim level i mean even your, your electrical fuses, your uh, breaker box, uh, really is all in a nice, neat, organized manner. 
and when you're done it's not like you have to tear into a dash to get to it just really easy easy to get to all right now as we come into the bedroom you're going to notice just how big this hallway is typically coming into the bedroom you're going to have a door about two foot six inches in uh, with the competition but with Newmar, i like how they just made this a nice big open space now if this is too open you can adjust this to where you have just one door or two doors two doors wide and this is going to be a sleep number king bed and it should be yeah it does have a remote control here no wires attached and you can adjust it to your preference now each side of the bed is going to have a wireless phone charging system that little round dot you just set your phone over the round dot and then there you go you got your little phone charger i do like this nice this big beautiful window they got back here you do have all the same functions now as we go through this coach you're going to notice the multiplex wiring here now this is going to be able to control your lights and things of that nature this particular coach i'm going to show you now we're just going to give you a little quick peek at what we got underneath here okay so uh now laying down in the bed uh, this is actually facing the, the underneath part of the cabinet. All these, uh, the functionalities as far as uh, closing the shades for the coach. Um, over here, you've got all the different light functions. But you, with the other nice feature is you can also start and stop the generator. So uh, if you have a quiet time um, and you're at an, a place that uh, doesn't allow you to run the generator, well, if you're in bed and you know you're, it's going to start getting hot soon and uh, it's it's uh, the time where you can actually turn on your generator. You don't have to get out of bed. You can sit here, push it, start your generator. Now you got your air conditioners running and you're good to go. So just a nice little functionality there for you. All right, guys. So we saw the functionality there as you're laying down in the bed. You've actually got the same kind of control central that you had up there in the front as far as climate control, seeing what your water levels are, um, controlling the climate, turning on the key to tile floor is going to all be done here. Now as we come over here and we look at the cabinetry, uh, I just love this. I love the, the beauty that Newmar has done with these cabinets. The hardware that they put on it, absolutely timeless. And uh, the built-ins, just plenty of drawer space. You got lots of little storage here. Pretty nice, all soft closing drawers come through here you got some bigger ones down here below so pretty neat little you know watches jewelry you're gonna have plenty of plenty of storage for all your little knickknacks it's got the nice Sony TV with the Bose speaker here nice really big Bose speaker they did not want to skimp on that and just more now what I've seen some people do is they'll get rid of the drawers and they would rather have uh, hanging you know maybe you want to hang some dresses or something there so completely doable all right now we're going to make our way into the bathroom and this is where you'd have your stack stack washer and dryer it is a whirlpool so i like the location as you're doing your laundry here you take it out throw it up on the bed right easy access as we come over here and we look at the I, look, I like to call it the Jack and the Jill sink. You got these nice raised bowls here. What that does, it just allows for a lot of extra counter space. If these bowls were actually rest, recessed into the countertop, you wouldn't be able to, you know, you'd lose a little bit of counter space. So as you can see, as I put my phone around here, you know, brushes, razors, uh, combs. I mean, you just got all the room in the world. And I love how they, like the hardware just kind of waterfalls right out of this beautiful stone backsplash just really nicely done you do have a medicine cabinet here it does have a 110 outlet out, out there so if you got a blow dryer you got a place to plug into um, you got outlet here you got an outlet over there you got plenty of drawer space you got just lots and lots of storage nice deep drawers all soft clothes and you've got some extra storage here and i like how they light up when you open up the doors Got another medicine cabinet over here. So you got the his and her set up. 
got the really nice uh, it's a cedar line closet you got the extensions for your dinette table there You've got the shoe garage here a lot of extra storage nice deep storage there towels linens you know whatever you want now for one of the best parts of this whole coach the shower I just absolutely love this shower the stone I don't think I've seen anything uh, I've seen some coaches maybe put it in the floor but I like how they ran the stone up the wall here and this is really nice this is something that you just don't see a lot of coaches you've got the the nice shower heads down on the lower part up in the middle and then up on top so just a beautiful arrangement here uh, I think anybody would be extremely happy with with taking a shower in here so guys this is uh, a beautiful coach I sure would love to uh, go over this coach with some more if you'd like to do a FaceTime video where I maybe do a walk around the coach with you and we can talk about the features and benefits and I can kind of point out some things that may be important to you I sure would love to help you um, please give me a call I'd love to help you my number is 208 290-5750 and for all the rest of the people out there looking just keep in mind we're looking for RVs 2011 or newer or any kind of truck we sure would love to give you a buy bid on those give me a holler look forward to helping you